GiroMed Institute is founded by a group of experts in the design, develop, and manage of medical products, and also in the healthcare service. And we also collaborate with the international group of researchers. A sleep apnea syndrome is a high prevalence disease. Around 8% of the general population who suffer this disease. The people who suffer of sleep apnea syndrome also have an additional risk to suffer cardiovascular disease such as arrhythmia, heart attack, and also uh, traffic accidents. The use of IOPT in medicine will allow us to adequately manage the treatment, the adherence, and compliance in patients affected of sleep apnea syndrome. That way, we can reduce the morbidity and mortality. Based on our experience in the medical sector, we found an unsolved problem that we would like to tackle with the design and development of an intelligent mandibular advanced device using a basic technology of intraoral sensors. And to reach this goal, it was really important the knowledge and technology of Eurecat. For Eurecat, the development of this medical device has been a big technological challenge. We have designed an IoT medical device that monitors vital signs as heart rate, saturation of oxygen, and head position. The main challenge has been to design the device as small as possible because it has to be integrated in a ferula. For that, Eurecat has used the latest technologies on manufacturing and electronics. The project has been possible thanks to a multidisciplinary team of Eurecat, electronic engineers, mechanical designers, software developers, and other specialists have been working in this project. We have developed a platform that helps the doctors to monitor the patients thanks to artificial intelligence. Eurecat has the ability to help the companies from the idea to the final product, going through the feasibility study, patentability, proof of concept, prototypes, homologation, and industrialization. Finally, after five years of develop, we have a product. We are like really happy because in the results of the clinical trials, we can be sure the compliance of the treatment system 100% of cases. And also, if we put a sensor into the mouth that could measure the saturation of oxygen, the hair beats, the position during the time you sleep, you have all these data that you can put into algorithm and make a prediction. This way, we are going to be sure that we are going to reduce the cost of sanitary costs. And also, and maybe the most important, is increase in the quality of life of the patients.